Hey guys, what is up? It is SSD Middleman here with Guides for Us All, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get the Great Bear Grenade Rifle in Fallout New Vegas. So, what you're going to need to do is play through the Lonesome Road DLC until you get to the end, and choose to redirect the missiles towards the NCR. Once you've done that, you will unlock the Long 15, which is the highly irradiated area that you decided to nuke. Once you head into the Long 15, you will realize that you are definitely going to need a Rad Suit or Ulysses Breathing Mask, because it has a plus 50 Rad Resistant. Make sure to bring some Rad Away and some Rad X as well to help you out with that. You're going to face a lot of powerful ghouls in power armor, uh, especially this boss here named Colonel Royas. You're going to need to bring a very powerful gun. Uh, I suggest armor piercing rounds if you're not very good at getting headshots. I'm using AP rounds here, but I'm getting headshots. I don't know why I was doing that. But if you get the headshots, it'll negate his uh, his armor, obviously. Anyways, once you take care of Colonel Royas, go up to this gun case that's behind him, and you will find the Great Bear Grenade Rifle, plus some ammo to back it up show you where it's at on the map here just basically on the bottom of the long 15 so now that we have the gun let's check out some gameplay with it now i know i normally go to the gamora and light things up but this time i'm doing something a little different i went to the quarry junction just to show off how powerful this grenade rifle is especially with its knockdown ability so you guys can watch me take out some death claws at long range with this bad boy and i'm going to read to you about it off the wiki so the uh, Great Bear Grenade Rifle has the appearance of just a regular grenade rifle, but with a blue American Army-like symbol on the stock. It's also kind of blue uh, underneath the barrel where you hold on to it. Uh, it can fire about 1,245 standard rounds before breaking from full condition, and that is crazy. How the hell are you going to manage to shoot 1,245 grenades out of this thing? If you can do that, I will be completely impressed. So some notes about the weapon, the Great Bear Grenade Rifle originally appeared as cut content textures and meshes in the game files of Old World Blues, named as Scorpion Rifle along with the projectiles, but as you can see, they obviously added it into Lonesome Road. The only way to access this weapon is to nuke the NCR the end of Lonesome Road. There's literally no other way to get it unless, of course, you have a PC version and you can just use console commands to get it, but what fun is that? This weapon is heavier than the Red Victory Grenade Rifle, but makes up for it by doing more damage. Now, that is true, but it only weighs one pound more than the Red Victory Grenade Rifle, so it's not that big of a weight difference. And this weapon is not affected by Grunt, which really sucks because Grunt increases the damage of grenade rifles by 25%. So if this thing was affected by Grunt, it would be absolutely amazing, but unfortunately it is not. So some behind the scenes, the Great Bear Grenade Rifle is based on the real world M79 grenade launcher from the early 60s, pretty cool. So as you can see, the Great Bear Grenade Rifle is a pretty phenomenal weapon to use against powerful enemies such as Death Claws as it has a high chance to knock them down. And once it has knocked them down, you can just switch to another weapon, like I'm using my hunting rifle here to switch to, and just keep shooting at them until they get back up, then knock them right back down with the Great Bear Grenade Rifle. So this weapon is very versatile and useful in many situations, of course. If you're just fighting people, launch it into a crowd of people. Destroy them. Also note that if you're using incendiary rounds, it will launch enemies into the air after they die. And it is hilarious, and it is awesome, and I love it. So that's pretty much all I have to say about this weapon. If you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like rating down below, and subscribe to see some more videos in the future, uh, and let me know if you enjoyed using the Great Bear Grenade Rifle. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.